He went from the small rural town of Castledale to Provo and then to the NBA for 12 years. Former BYU basketball and NBA star Sean Bradley has suffered a life-altering injury. He was the victim of a terrible bike accident in St. George that came to light just today. Fox 13's Morgan Vance joins us in studio this afternoon. Morgan, tell us what happened. Yeah, Bob Kelly, in terms of cougar lore, at 7 feet 6 inches tall, Sean has always literally risen above the rest, but now Bradley's life might be permanently altered. The incident happened a couple of months ago, actually, on January 20th. He was riding his bike in southern Utah when he was struck by a vehicle that left him paralyzed with a traumatic spinal cord injury. The Dallas Mavericks, the team Bradley spent the majority of his career with, released this statement today. We are saddened to hear of Sean's accident. Sean has always been incredibly determined and shown a fighting spirit. We wish him nothing but the best in his recovery. He will always be a part of our Mavs family. At this point, we know he spent the last eight weeks in the hospital rehabilitating after undergoing neck fusion surgery. Following an LDS mission in one season at BYU where Bradley set records in the blocked shots department, he was taken second overall by the 76ers in the 93 draft. Former teammate and current Brooklyn Nets coach Steve Nash reacted this way upon hearing the news. It's obviously heartbreaking to hear. He is a, you know, a fun-loving guy and a, and a teammate of mine, I think, for six years. So, you know, ter ter terrible news. And you know, I hope he remains positive and has a lot of support and continue to, to fight and find some comfort and hopefully to improve and get as much function back as he can. But uh, obviously really sad news to hear today. Yeah, the statement also said that Bradley intends to turn this tragedy into a positive, bringing awareness to bicycle safety. Morgan Vance, Fox 13 News.